Hitch Dolls, it's Emmeline. So I am super excited for this week's video. We are doing another weekly vlog. You guys seem to love these. And this week's vlog is gonna be so exciting. We're doing so many fun things uh, this week. And I also wanted to mention that today's video is gonna be sponsored by Poshmark. So later on, I'm gonna show you guys a bunch of things I'm gonna to add to my Poshmark. Every time I do a video with Poshmark, you guys get super excited because I upload tons of clothes. We're actually having a huge garage sale tomorrow. I have so much stuff, it's actually embarrassing that <laughs> it's gonna be, um, that like I have to sell at the garage sale. So I decided to take some of it, like some of the cute clothes and to add them to Poshmark. But basically what we're doing today is we are going into the city and we're gonna go to La Durée, Henry Bendel's, basically do all of my favorite things I love to do. And then afterwards we're meeting Connor's friends for a Mets game. Okay, so here is my outfit for today. I call this my Bahama Mama top. I just feel like it has that like Caribbean kind of vibe. Do I say Caribbean or Caribbean? I say Caribbean. Um, but this is from Princess Polly. The back is like all open. It's so cute. Um, basically just ties right there. These earrings um, are old. I got them. I don't know like if they're like vintage or if they're just, I don't know. I got these at the uh, Country Living Fair. My necklace I always wear. Um, Jess got this from me, I'm pretty sure it's from Etsy. I feel like I never show you guys jewelry, but I'll do it. Um, so this ring is, if I was ever to get a tattoo, this is the tattoo I would get. So when I saw it in a ring form, I had to get it. This is from Pure Vida, Pura Vida, I don't know, something like that. If I can find it, I'll list it for you guys below. This ring says cutie on it. I actually got this made on Etsy when she passed away. My bangle is from Movement, and then the dream bracelet is from Henry Bendel's. This skirt is from Brandy Melville. Yeah, it's from Brandy Melville. And then I got some Vans on. Back at it again with the white Vans. <laughs> so I just have these Vans on because if you guys don't know, I have really bad back issues, so when I know I'm gonna be walking a lot, I need to wear like sneakery types of shoes. But that is my outfit for today. So before we actually go into the city, Connor and I haven't announced this yet because I just haven't had like the opportunity to in a video, but Connor and I are starting to look at houses. So we are super excited to look at houses together and everything like that. So we have to go to the bank today. Um, and just figure out exactly how much we can afford. So we're gonna get that all figured out. So super quick before I go, I just wanted to show you guys what I'm gonna be posting on to Poshmark. So basically, if you guys don't know what Poshmark is, it's a app and you can either list your clothes and sell them or you guys can buy clothes and everything. It's usually like up to 50% off or over. So it's really good because you guys can get like designer clothes like Nike or like Michael Kors, whatever it is you want for really cheap and I love the app so much. I just wanna show you guys super quick everything that I'm gonna be listing. If you guys do have a closet, make sure to put your closet names down below so I can follow you, maybe buy some of your stuff. But I wanted to show you guys quick the things that I'm gonna be listing. So I have these adorable skirts from Misguided. They're like these cute little like, I don't know how to explain them, like little tennis skirts, I guess. They're so cute and you can easily dress them up or down. They look really cute with like white sneakers. I have two of these. I just like, they're one of those things that I have in my closet that I just always forget to wear. So I was like, I should just sell them, let them go to a better home. Then I have these really adorable gingham shoes. I've actually never even worn these. Again, this was something that I bought that I was like, I can't wait to wear these. And then like, I just never wore them, but they are so, stinking cute and I think they look adorable on someone. Um, another thing I have is this really cute dress. It's like a midi dress and it has this like deep V, it has ruffled sleeves, it's so pretty. And this top, every time I would wear this, you guys would always ask me where it's from. It is so beautiful, this shirt. I love it so much. I just feel like I've gotten enough use out of it. Um, but the sleeves are just so pretty. I am so obsessed with this shirt, so make sure to go check out my Poshmark. My closet name is Sweet Emmeline's 2. So here is my closet. You guys can download the free app using the link in the description box. So I just wanted to show you guys some of the clothes I have listed. So definitely go check it out. 
and also leave your closet name so that I can follow you guys. You guys, my mom literally just texted me after I said we're having our garage sale tomorrow and she said that it's supposed to, like we're supposed to have thunderstorms tomorrow. So she thinks that we should not have a garage sale now tomorrow. So I was excited for you guys to come along with that part, but it's most likely probably gonna have to wait so I could vlog that again another time. But um, we'll see, hopefully, the thunderstorms get canceled and that's not gonna happen. But anyway, right now I have to leave to go to the bank. And yeah, okay, I'm gonna go. Guys, we are at the place where they filmed Gossip Girl. This was like Serena's um, apartment complex. Okay guys, we just got to Lauderbay. So many macarons. Alright, so we're deciding what to macarons to get. Connor wants Marie Antoinette. Pistachio. This is Connor's first time. What do you think of it so far? Nice. You think it's nice? Tea time. This is my favorite tea to get from here. It is so good. You guys, I made Connor hold like all of this stuff just so I could get a nice picture. <laughs> He's like so over it right now. Thank you, Con. All he wants to do is eat, and I'm just like, wait a minute. Look how cute the little chocolate is. The next video I film should be the boyfriend tag because it has been way overdue. Give this video a thumbs up and also leave a comment letting me know if that's what you think we should do because I feel like you guys need to meet Connor. It's been way too long. I don't know which one to try first. Can you like feed me one? <laughs> He's getting so annoyed at me today because I'm like making him take pictures and stuff. If your boyfriends get mad at you for that. <laughs> Good. All right, we're about to try <laughs> the Marie Antoinette one. What is that? What's that? It tastes like the two we just had, so maybe that's what it is. All right, Connor, what was your reaction to La Durée? Uh, ooh, la la. Ooh, la la. Did you like it? You think it's worth it going back again? Yeah. We for some reason got like free shirts oh. when we were walking in. So random. But anyway, we're going to our we're going to our seats now. I put on my sweatshirt. It's a little chilly. All right, I don't know if you guys can hear me, but we are, we got like the best seats ever somehow. Or like, we're right up front. It's so perfect. We're like right by everything. There's like a little lounge area. I know. I don't know, how, how did we get these seats? Huh? How did we get these seats? I feel like they're so good. Online. Huh? Online. Oh. Go on uh, the internet. Oh my gosh. No, but it's like this like whole like, I feel very bougie up here. It's like this whole like little private area. They gave us like a shirt. There's like a seating area with like sofas with like little picture areas. It's pretty cool. You guys, I'm so excited. They actually have veggie burgers up here. This is like making me so happy. So I just put like a ton of stuff on it. And of course we get some french fries. Okay, 
you guys, I needed to talk to you about those last few clips from the other night because you guys are probably like, what the heck was that? So basically what ended up happening was like during the baseball game, well, first of all, we randomly got like amazing seats and like everything was like very nice. Like you guys saw there was like lounge areas and stuff like that and we were like so shocked. So then we, like during the baseball game, they kept saying that there was gonna be like a Busta Rhymes concert like at the end of the game and we were so confused. Like we were like, what is this? And then, so we stayed for like the concert part and then like all of a sudden, he was like, and here's my friend Jaden Smith. And then Jaden Smith pops out and then he starts performing. Like it was the weirdest night. And then whenever you go home from the city, like on the train at night, like late, we, the weirdest things happen. Like you have to like be prepared for that. So there was like this guy, he was just so like ready for life. And we were all like so tired. And there was like a bunch of girls. I don't know if they were like on a bachelorette party or like something like that, but like they were just, so lit like they were like ready to go and so the the guy was like who's ready to turn this train into a party train and then he was like whoever doesn't want to be on the party car like needs to go to like the next car down so he like starts playing cardi b and he was just like dancing and like the girls were dancing he was like rapping like all the girls were rapping it was like the most entertaining thing because normally like when people are crazy on the train at night it's like kind of scary and just kind of like you feel weird but like this was like genuinely like you could just tell he was like like a nice person and just like wanting to have fun it was very entertaining for the train ride home we were just like laughing the entire time it was so funny so i just got back from church it's like one o'clock now and i'm so hungry so i got like a bunch of sushi and i decided to like treat myself to a chill day today because i feel like i'm just like always doing so much stuff and never just like relaxing and watching a movie or something so i'm gonna try to watch like some girly movies eat some sushi maybe like paint my nails i have not painted my nails in i don't even know how long and just kind of like have a little pamper day maybe take a bubble bath do all the kind of stuff that i love doing that i just never get the chance to do tiggy Hi, he's so cute. What are you doing? He just keeps like rubbing his head all over me. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to eat right now and also no strings attached is on. So it's like the perfect combo, sushi and girly movies. This is literally the best. I wanted to show you what um, Brianna and I are putting together for Alyssa's bridal shower in case any of you guys are uh, looking for ideas for your friend's bridal shower. Oh, Wilbur's at the door. He wants to go outside. Um, I thought I would show you guys what we're doing and I'm going to put this together right now, actually. So I'm going to make the box. I just thought it was so cute. So I want to show you guys everything we got. Okay. So this box is from TJ Maxx. How cute. It says together is my favorite place to be. And then it just has, Oh, really? What is all this? So David to Tara, I don't know if you guys, if you guys are young, you guys probably don't remember the show, but uh, I used to always watch David to Tara's uh, wedding show. I think he has like some other shows now, but he has a bunch of cute things um, at Michael's. So we got, he is so intrigued. Oh, really? We got her a bunch of these cute things. And then we got some of that like fun cray paper. We got her some glasses. We still need to get a few more things. Like we're thinking of trying to find her some cute like wedding pajamas um, and stuff. And we also did get her something from her registry. She wanted a juicer. So we also got her that. So you just wanted to like get like also a little something more personal. So I'm going to put this <laughs> together right now and show you guys what it looks like so far. You guys, Wilbur has never gotten out of the puppy phase of tearing receipts. And it, honestly, it makes me so happy when he does it. Because he just like, he's so happy. And I just think it's the cutest thing ever when he does it. <laughs> Willie, you are so funny. 
Okay, so here is the box so far. I think we definitely need more paper because it's kind of low, so like we want to fill it up like really high. But everything looks super cute in here. I think that this crown is like so pretty too. Starting my pamper day and Bride Wars is on right now. It's like my favorite movie because it's so funny. But anyway, I'm just taking off my makeup right now and then um, I'm gonna put on this like new treatment that I got when I got a facial the other week. So I'm excited to see like how it makes my skin. She said it's supposed to make my skin like super smooth. So I'm excited, but I also just wanted to mention that I did post um, on my blog a whole skincare routine and I'll like put the before and after pictures here. You guys can see my skin has like completely changed over the past year and um, my skin is just like so amazing now. So I wanted to make a blog post for you guys because I'm always getting questions about my skin. So you guys can check that out. I'll have the link for it in the description box. Okay, I just washed my face. I feel so much better. I feel like I have so much to update you guys on with my life and things have just been like so crazy lately i've just been like i don't know it's just like when like literally like everything always hits at once like 500 different things and then your life is just like a mess that's how i've been feeling lately but that's why i'm like just taking today as like a chill relaxed day because i just need to breathe a little bit but right now i'm using this stuff that the last time I got a facial, she recommended it to me. Um, it's Paula's Choice Skin Perfecting 2% BHA liquid and it has salicylic acid in it. Um, so she said it's kind of like, not like a peel, but she said it's just like unclogs like all of like your pores and she said it's good to do like every couple weeks or so. It's just like a very light um, exfoliant kind of. So. We'll see how that does. I have the bathtub filling up and I'm gonna put a bath bomb in, take a nice bath, just relax, feel so nice and I have makeup on. So I just got out of the bath and I made some watermelon juice. I like drank so much of it though because I was so thirsty. So basically all I do is just take a watermelon and cut it into chunks and just put it in the blender and that is it. It is so refreshing and so good. It's my favorite thing to drink in the whole world. So I'm just gonna finish watching Bride Wars and just relax. Okay guys, so I just wanted to end off the vlog here. I feel like this was kind of like a quick vlog. Like I feel like there's a lot of footage, but I feel like, but I feel like not as much happened as I thought was going to because like our yard sale got canceled and like a lot of my plans ended up like getting canceled. So it's more of just like a relaxed video, but let me know if you guys enjoyed it and also be sure to check out my Poshmark closet. Like I said, everything will be in the description box down below. And if you guys want the next video to be a boyfriend tag, also leave a comment because I feel like that would be so fun to do. And I think it's time that you guys meet Connor. So I hope you guys are all having an amazing day and I'll talk to you guys next time.